education and high-quality content is out of reach for many people in different parts of the world due to the constraints of time, space, and economics. However, with mobile technology, subway commutes, air travels, or waiting for an appointment can become virtual mini-classrooms. Arlington Public News interviewed Qualcomm Senior Director of Business Development, Muhab Ramsis, about the technology that Qualcomm develops and the ways it can be used to improve education through connectivity. My name is, uh, is Muhab Ramsis and uh, I'm the Senior Director for Business Development uh, covering the area or responsible for the area of uh, Middle East, North Africa and Central Asia. We are mainly a wireless technology development company. So our core business is technology. Our core business is developing advanced technologies for wireless. Connectivity is changing many industries in our lives. We asked how Qualcomm technologies could affect the education industry. Education is part of the industries that can really make maximum benefit of uh, the connectivity because the quality of education depends not only on what happens inside the classroom, but also a big part of it happens outside the classroom. What connectivity can provide education with is the possibility to connect in any place. So when you're, you're at school, you can have access to specific material. When you're outside, you can have access to other material. There's so many things that can be done on the education side. At the end, I'm not saying that I like books. I, I like printed books. I'm not saying that will disappear, but I think that will be optimized and kind of enriched with uh, so many interactive content that will be empowered by connectivity. The world is changing today considerably because of connectivity, because of everything connected. And uh, we sometimes we do the mistake of looking at uh, technology as a luxury. Education is the same. It's not really quality of education is not a luxury. It's what we need today to create a healthy environment and healthy society where jobs are created in a more efficient way. And I think this is the challenge that uh, we are trying to overcome. Mobility isn't the only technology that is improving education. We asked Qualcomm about future technologies like augmented reality that may affect education as well. Augmented reality is based on uh, mixing reality with uh, imagination or with the non-reality, with the virtual world. The camera or the smartphone will recognize this specific shape and then it will trigger some sort of action. There are some applications already uh, using augmented reality for uh, education. I think it can really enhance the education experience. You see the word apple, for example, talk about apple, the fruit, and then it pops up, uh, the apple pops up in a 3D format to the student, so he will know exactly what is an apple. And that's just a very basic example of how it can help. This is Lauren Alejandro with Arlington Public News.